time to open 50 elite caskets. These did take me quite a while, but before anything, I'll go to the collection log and I am currently 61 out of 71 items. And as you see, I am missing two masks, mainly the bronze dragon mask and the full set of Drudric. Although I only need one piece technically, which I did get a staff. So all I need is two dragon masks and I'll have the basic collection log completed. The golden version of it will be every single piece unlocked. And I will now be opening pretty much just the clues. I'll be doing it pretty fast, but not too fast so you're able to look at the loot and stuff to see how much fortune components and the price of some i believe it's the puzzle not skipping tickets those are extremely expensive they're about three million coins each which yes a lot of people do actually use them Although I'm not that rich, rich to do it. And right there, I just got a bat mask. Which luckily, it was not a dragon cane. Because that would have been a failed roll on getting a blood die. Which I believe I have three or maybe four of them. And then, there we go. I got a dragon staff. Which I'm not sure if that's a failed roll or anything. But it's always nice just to have it for the collection of purposes which again i'm just 61 out of 71 and there's back to back master clues and sadly we did not get a third back to back and then just look at those three pages of sardomen and then for some, some reason you will get a ton, and I mean a ton, of Dragon Helms. Pretty much almost every one I was opening for the most part, I got a Dragon Helm, and then another Dragon Helm, and then I got that double, as you did see. And of course, any loot under about, I want to say 400k, if I'm able to re-roll that, I will re-roll it, because it's always nice to have a chance to get a die, unless... There is a master scroll, in which case I won't re-roll because that are extremely hard to get. I believe it's a 25% chance from opening an elite casket. And if I do have plans on opening loot from 100 master clues, it will take me quite a while to do that. So collecting them is pretty slow, but... It's 100% worth it, even if it's horrible loot. As you do, do see, sometimes I'm getting like 140k value. But because it has that master scroll, I pretty much have to keep it. That's the only downside of it. But hey, eventually the rerolls, they will get me a die. And if you've noticed... There is a pretty good amount of super restores and super uh, regular anti-fire potions that I do have. I'm pretty sure those are a failed chance on a shadow die. And then there we go, a crystal triskeline piece. I don't even want to know how rare that one is. And then there's the ornament kit. And look at that, a cat mask, this time, a cat staff. So, and there we go, a wolf mask. I'm getting pretty much every staff possible. Although, just imagine if I get a Drudric staff. Although, I do have that one already. And right here, it's 144k, so of course I'm re-rolling that to almost 500k. Keep in mind that the prices may vary, because there's always a lot of updates that I like to think they price manipulate 
the clue scroll items because most recently we didn't have that what shadow core or something we're able to get from the wilderness events to make people do it and for the final clue a master which pretty much ended perfectly so let's go to the collection log and again i was 61 out of 71 and i did get eight master clues and what do you know i did not get a single unique so yeah that's a little bit awkward and again i just need two masks and i'll unlock the basic tier of the elite title with that thank you all so much for watching and enjoy the rest of your day don't forget to like subscribe and comment as it really does help